Hey, how are you doing AP Econ students? It's Mr. Clifford. It's time for some quick practice on the spending multiplier. What I have for you is the marginal penalty consume under four different scenarios. I want you to calculate the spending multiplier so you understand this concept. Keep in mind the spending multiplier is the idea that when money is spent in the economy, it gets multiplied as other people spend some of it and save some of that money. Go ahead and do your calculations. Good luck. All right, here we go. Let's figure it out. The marginal penalty consume is 0.9. That means the marginal penalty to save is 0.1. So 1 over 0.1, which is 1 over 1 tenth, the multiplier would be 10. There's your answer, 10. For marginal penalty to consume at 0.8, it's 1 over 0.2, because that's the marginal penalty to save, which is 1 over 1 fifth, which is equal to 5. All right. For the next one, it's 1 over 1 half, which is equal to 2. That's the multiplier. And for this last one, it's 1 over 1. Because if the marginal penalty to consume is nothing, that means people save all of their stuff, right? All their income. And so that's 1 over 1. Grand total is 1. Now, look at the numbers. This is why I showed up to you in this exact order. As the marginal penalty to consume gets smaller, what happens to the size of the multiplier? It gets smaller, which makes sense, right? If you put money in the system and people spend a whole lot of it, 90% of it, then that multiplier is going to be super high and it's going to multiply a lot because other people get it and other people get it and multiply it a lot. As you decrease the amount people spend, in other words, increase the amount people save, that means the spending multiplier has less of an effect. So in fact, if the marginal benefit to consume is zero and people save every dime, right, when there's an increase in spending in the economy, that has no ripple effect whatsoever. The multiplier would actually be one. Okay, hopefully it makes sense. We're going to use it in the next video. Till next time.